Hey guys, in today's video I'll be sharing my top 10 tips in Destiny. After you level up one class to 15, you unlock the subclasses for any and all classes. As you can see, my level 5 Titan can be a striker or a defender. You can use the vault in the tower to consolidate any materials you've gathered and even any weapons you've accumulated. Relating to the last tip, you can create a max of 3 classes and each day do a world event and if they are even level 20, you can do the daily story to accumulate ascended materials and strange coins at 3 times the rate. You can use bounty turn-ins to level up subclasses you don't like playing and level up weapons you currently aren't using but might in the future. This also allows you to level up weapons on 3 classes using the bounties, reducing the time it takes to level up exotics or legendaries by three times the amount which allowed me to level up my invective in just two days playtime. If you do every bounty each day you can get an exotic bounty near the end of the week for a guaranteed exotic weapon and again if you have three twenties you can get all three exotic weapons in just the first week. Make sure that if you come across any materials at any point playing, be sure to collect them. They're used to upgrade all your weapons and armor including exotics and legendaries. If you find all the golden chests on earth, you can get the level 15 upgraded sparrow as early as level 4. I also have a guide on how to find all 5 chests, so click on the annotation if you need help. If you know you're ever going to find all of the golden chests, make sure to do it as soon as you unlock the world, because the gear is predetermined and can really help you out at the lower levels while being useless at level 20. Don't worry about doing any of the missions on the hard. As long as you're picking up each bounty, you'll never be underleveled or forced to grind to 20. So the XP bonus from hard is really irrelevant. The last tip isn't much help, but when you're playing the story, most missions that are before your sparrow is linked, you can actually use it, even on the very first story mission before it even lets you know that you have a sparrow. Thanks for watching my top 10 tips for Destiny. If you liked the video and want to see more, make sure to subscribe and click that like button. I'll see you guys next time.